Uh, our next guest, whose family vacationed in Yellowstone, had to take a detour to get to safety. Jennifer Rue, thank you so much for being with us. Uh, walk us through exactly what you experienced on your recent visit to Yellowstone this week. Yeah, we arrived in Jackson on Saturday and spent a couple days at the Grand Tetons and then intended to enter Yellowstone through the southern entrance yesterday morning. And as we pulled up, they were erecting a sign uh, on the road saying Yellowstone closed. And while we had noticed that water levels were pretty high, we had no idea that they were that bad. And uh, so we stopped and spoke with the, the man on the road and he informed us that they were evacuating the park, that all five entrances were closed and that we'd have to turn back. And so we went back to a visitor center where everyone else was in the same situation. We were all intending to go into the park. So we were all scrambling to try to find accommodation and alternative plans. In terms of high water, we saw this home that we keep showing time and time again because it's just so dramatic. Uh, but what was your experience? How fast is the water moving in and around Yellowstone from your perspective? We're at the southern end of Yellowstone and most of the severe damage that you're seeing is at the northern end. And so I think that things are gonna get worse in the southern end of the park today and probably into Jackson. Um, but the Snake River is the major river that, that flows from Yellowstone down into Jackson. And we've certainly noticed that the water is moving very, very quickly and the levels are really high. Are, so you're able to salvage some part of your vacation there in Yellowstone, you're at higher ground. We are at higher ground. We're in Jackson, and Jackson's a, a lovely city, but we did not intend to spend our eight-day vacation just here. So we are quite disappointed, um, but very happy that we didn't get stuck in a crisis situation and our safety was never um, a question. Had you talked to any other vacationers who were there at Yellowstone about their experience? Yeah, there's everyone at the hotel is folks like us intended to be entering the park yesterday and they all turned back and so i was at the pool yesterday with my son uh, speaking with other travelers and we're all just trying to figure out what we should be doing most of the activities in jackson are focused on water activities so fly fishing or rafting etc and obviously we're not going to get out on the water under these conditions so we're just trying to figure out what to do to, to keep ourselves busy for this vacation Oh, my gosh. Well, I'm sure you guys are going to have lots of memories together around maybe some s'mores or watching some <laughs> movies. All right. Thank you, Jennifer. Good to see you. And, and I hope you guys make the best of it. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.